Okay, now I feel good about our first time saddling. I don't want my saddle to get all, you know, covered in snow. Come on, let's go for a walk. Today we're doing a quick little video on it's not about the bag, or it's not about the saddle, or it's not about the saddle blanket. It's never about the stuff. It's about your horse's ability to stay down regulated and not trigger off of stimulus. So we're gonna go over here with Viking and we're gonna put the first saddle on Viking and get him going on his first saddle. I love seeing horses put the saddle on for the first time. I mean, I don't even wanna ask him about the saddle until he and I have got some ground rules in place. So the first thing that I need to be able to have here with Viking is I've gotta be able to go in and stand next to him and have his head and neck bent to the side and have my hands on his hip. So we're just gonna relax, think happy thoughts, and just get him to settle down and hold his feet still. And then we're gonna get out and let him have that dopamine release. Look at that, he's actually stepping towards me because he knows he wants to stay down regulated, he wants to relax. So we're waiting for the dopamine let his mind trickle down, let that come in. Cause I, gotta, I wanna keep his mind engaged. I wanna keep him relaxed with me cause it could be really easy for him to find panic. So we've already done the brain work. We're just putting it to the test. We want him to just stay relaxed. I love this. I mean, he's doing fantastic. I'm probably more nervous than he is. I've never done this before. This stuff is bugging the heck out of me. It's, flapping in my ears and yeah, I think I'm more nervous. So ah, let me take a big breath. Do my own little licking and chewing. See if I can relax. But we got in on that side. We want to come around on this side and just give him an opportunity to look for an answer that he's never looked for before. So we're just going to stay with him and ask him to find an answer he's never looked for. So we gotta let him keep looking so that he can find that answer. Oh boy, here we go. Almost got in there, almost. Now I just gotta stay with him until his feet settle and he can figure out how to deal with this. So here we got him, now we're just gonna wait till his feet find some calmness. Oh boy. Other than I've just got to follow the chemical state of his mind and I got to let this cortisol find its way out. And once the cortisol is out, he'll relax. Oh, almost. So close. There it is. And then I'm going to get out and let him have the mental time to seek a little relief here. So I want him to lick and chew. And there it is. So his reticular activating system is processing all of this stimulus. Ah, we're gonna die for sure. But the stimulus stays there. All right, let's go see what our wild Mustang has to say about this saddle. You notice how there's nothing to do with the bags? I mean, the bags mean absolutely nothing to him just because he's already decided that he's okay. All right, so we're just gonna throw this saddle on like we've thrown it on a hundred times already so that he can just find his way to be okay with it. Up and on and just let it sit there. So that's first time putting the saddle on this guy. Boy, now I know what you ladies feel like with hair on windy days. It's just blowing all around in my face. All right, let's get this guy cinched up. Point of the moral of the story, it's not about the bags, right? I mean, it might have been about the bags for like the first minute on each side, and then after that, there was nothing to do about the bags. It was all about him just seeking mental safety. Where's that mental relief? How and where does he find it? because it has nothing to do with these bags. The, the bags are just like any other shirt I'd wear, so 
I don't have any of those fancy saddle covers, so we just kind of use whatever we got. Come here, big guy. I got to cover up that saddle. I don't want it to get rained on or snowed on. So if you learned something in this video or you found something interesting about the horse's brain and following the science and the chemical state of their mind in presenting them with some new stimulus, share this video with your horse friends. So maybe we'll start a new trend. You know, you can buy these fancy training jackets from me here at the ranch. $19.99 and you can have a training jacket like this. Guaranteed to train your wild Mustang the first day you wear it. You'll be able to put the saddle on your Mustang for the very first time, only if you have this training jacket. All right. <laughs> All right, let's be done, it's like snowing. Okay, 